This is Kim Gilby, and these are the girls. It is their first time in New York, and they're in hot pursuit of the naked cowboy. But first, Kim goes for $10,000 on who wants to be a I can't deliver the naked cowboy to you and the girls, but I do have a hot Capital One check for $1 million. That I can deliver to you. You only need to answer nine more questions to get to this point. You're going for the $10,000 question. You have all your lifelines left, including Ask the Expert, and today's expert is TV and radio personality. Kennedy is joining us, so that is a nice lady to help you out when you need her. Are you ready, Kim? I'm ready. Audience, are you ready? Yeah. Then let's play millionaire. All right, Kim, $10,000 question. First one out of the box here. It is your celebrity question. This one is worth, as I said, $10,000. let us see who it is. Hi, I'm Larry King of CNN's Larry King Live. Here's your question. In 2009, the Obamas introduced their newly adopted first canine, a Portuguese water dog, named what? Was it Bo, Skip, Jack, or Lee? Bo Jacob, I love you for putting all that stuff on Facebook, but I didn't need you. It's A, Bo, Mile. <laughs> all right, we're going to Let's show, audience. Let's see if you're right. In April 2009, the Obamas introduced the newest addition to their family, a Portuguese water dog named after Michelle's father, who was nicknamed Diddley, after the guitarist Bo Diddley. So that's how the first canine came to be named Bo, and you are the Good job, Kim, and thanks to our buddy Larry King for that celebrity question there. Appreciate it. All right, smarty pants, going for $12,500. In the 1970s, photojournalist Dith Prawn was a survivor of what country's notorious killing fields? Somalia, Colombia, Armenia, Cambodia. That would be D, Cambodia, final answer. I had the opportunity to meet him. He's a terrific photographer, lovely man. It is Cambodia. You got it right. much time for sitcoms? I do watch my share of TV. Oh, good. This is for 15000 See if this is one of the ones you like. The two main characters on what sitcom are named in honor of the legendary TV producer, Sheldon Leonard. The Big Bang Theory, How I Met Your Mother, Two and a Half Men, Scrubs. Oh, Meredith, I'm going to have to ask the audience because I do not know this one. No problem, audience. Kim needs your help. On your keep ads, vote now. Okay, Kim, 60% of the audience believes it is the Big Bang Theory. You have 22 seconds starting now. Okay, Meredith, um, you gotta have faith, and I think I've got faith in this audience, so don't let me down, audience, but I'm going to say, a, the Big Bang Theory, final answer. They did not let you down. It is a Big Bang Theory. All right, Kim. This is a very big question, $25,000 question. Can't leave with less than that if you get it right. Miss Universe is a category. Stefania Fernandez, who was crowned Miss Universe in 2009, is the beauty pageant's second straight winner from what country? Spain, Brazil, Argentina, Venezuela. Bummer. Um, I wish I'd watched it now, but I would like to um, ask the expert Kennedy. All right, the expert Kennedy right there. Hey, Kennedy, how you doing? Hey, Meredith, how are you? I'm good. Do you like beauty pageants? <laughs> I'm such a big beauty pageant fan, Meredith. Yeah. Look at me. Yeah, I can tell by looking at you. Well, we got a question for you that uh, has a little bit to do with that. It's for $25,000. I'm going to feed it to you right now. 
fuzzy on this. I remember reading that there were two winners in a row from one country. And I believe, but I'm not certain, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you a 30% degree of certainty that it is Venezuela. Okay, well, if that's the way, you know, if you think you read it and you think it, you remembered it, it was Venezuela, that is definitely something to... I would take it into consideration, but I wouldn't take it to the bank, as it were. Okay, well, I took... Thank like, if you have a feeling it's Venezuela... You know, I am so glad I used to watch you on MTV, you know, so I'm going to listen to you, but I'm also, I would. All right, let me say goodbye to Kennedy first. Kennedy, thank you very much. Thank you, Meredith. All right. Kennedy is saying, Venezuela, you're going to make up your own mind, though. You've got 20 seconds okay. starting now. And to be on the safe side, Meredith, I really would love to double dip. All right, we're going to double dip. To get them both wrong. You do drop down to $5,000. First answer, okay. Kim. I'm going to go with D, Venezuela, final. She was only 30% right, but she's 100% correct. Yeah. Yeah.